I, Tomoki Hachida, was a very shy kid. I was good at working diligently on my own, and I always got first place in tests and after school activities. Tomochi, you got a hundred on the test again? <laughs> wow! You're busy preparing for the presentation, but you still do great on the tests. Th thanks. This was probably the best time in my life. My life took a drastic turn when a genius appeared out of nowhere. She's Emily Ashia, and she'll be joining us from today. Hello! It's nice to meet you. The new girl attracted great attention. She's not only pretty, but also athletic and smart. Her parents worked for a famous entertainment agency. My friends who had been praising me quickly got obsessed with her who was like a heroine of a comic book. I didn't know how to start a conversation, so I gradually became isolated in class. Tomoki! Yes? I'll be doing the same after school activities as you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. For the next play, we'll have Emily play the main role. I lost against her in my after school activities as well, and I completely lost confidence in myself. I quit my after-school activities saying that I wanted to focus on my studies, and I got into an all-boys school for junior high in high school. It was easier for me to breathe now that she wasn't around me, but my relationship with others haven't changed. <laughs> and then... I was treated as if I didn't exist. I graduated high school, and here I am now. After graduating high school, I didn't pass my college exams, and I ended up jobless, shutting myself in my room. I don't want my parents to treat me like trouble, so during the day, I lock myself up in my room. But in the night, after my parents go to sleep, I sneak out of the house to visit the park every day. <sighs> hey there, Swing. It's a cold night, huh? How's it going, Slide? Looks like you're all doing great. I'm doing great too. I must look like a weirdo, talking to these playground equipments. This was my way of practicing how to communicate with people. I know I can't live like this forever, but what am I supposed to do now? Huh? What? When I looked behind, a woman who looked homeless in her worn out clothes was standing right beside me. Hey you. I, I'm sorry? When she grabbed my shoulder, I spontaneously just apologized for some reason. You mumbled about not knowing what to do now, right? Uh, about that. Looks like you're facing some difficulties. <laughs> yes. Tell me everything. It was my first time to have someone ask me that. Uh, I... But when I started to tell her everything that happened to me from the past to the present, about how this new girl who was a genius ruined everything, about myself knowing it's wrong to blame her for everything, but still not knowing what to do. I see. She listened to my depressing stories quietly. What am I doing here? I should go home. I'm going home. 
ะฮะ I think I heard a young woman's voice. But wait a minute. You have difficulty communicating with people because you don't listen to what others say. Uh, she has a point. I remember reading in a book about not knowing what to talk about when you don't pay enough attention to what people say. Okay, I'll read your fortune. What? I've heard about this. She's gonna make me pay an overly expensive price. One hundred million. Oh no! I can see your future. Someone would buy you for the price of one hundred million, and that person would change your life. Huh? What is she saying? Okay, I should run away. I quickly ran away from the scene. I'll be on my way very soon. Be prepared, Tomoki. Why does she know my name? Oh, it's a nightmare. A week after my horror experience, a woman I've never met visited us. I'm here to ask Mr. Tomoki to join my company. My parents were so surprised that they came to my room to call me downstairs. I quickly got dressed and went down to the living room. My name is Ashia from Nanakuma Production. What do you think about signing a contract with us? We'll pay you 100 million for the contract money. Wh 100, 100 million? million? When she told me the amount, I remember what the homeless woman told me the other day. Have we met before? No, what are you talking about? I, I'm sorry, it's nothing. There's no way this beautiful woman disguised herself that day. I guess I'm reading too much comics. Actually, I'm very close to the teacher who holds acting classes around this area, and he told me about Mr. Tomoki. Oh, is he the teacher who used to teach Tomoki when he was in elementary school? Yes, he showed me the videos of the past plays, and I knew Mr. Tomoki was worth it. Sounds like a lie. I was in elementary school when I last met my teacher. While I was suspicious, my parents next to me were... I knew you had talent! Go for it, Tomoki. You should definitely give it a try. Gosh... It's true that I've played many important roles in my acting classes until she came here. Wait... Her name was... Tomoki, what do you think? We'll support your decision, Tomoki. It's been so long since I've seen them look so lively. Uh, I'll do it. But I don't need the money. It's kind of scary. Are you both okay with that? Yes. Your happiness is more important than money. Mom. All right, let's work hard together, Mr. Tomoki. I, I, yes. Like that, I joined the Nanakuma Entertainment Agency. By the way, who are some popular actors and actresses under Namakuma Entertainment Agency? Someone who didn't know much about the entertainment agency like me had no idea. When I looked them up on my phone... Uh, huh? Emily Ashia? To my surprise, I found the photo of the pretty new girl on the top page. 
So, the CEO called Ashia who visited us is her family? Long time no see, Tomoki! Uh, Ashia! I couldn't hide my surprise, seeing her actually appear in front of me so suddenly. Oh? You didn't know that Emily was part of this agency? Seems like you still have a long way to go, Emily. <laughs> he just didn't know because he's a jobless shut-in. She called me a jobless shut-in. Jobless shut-in. I was aware of that myself. But hearing her, the very person who took everything away from me back in elementary school, call me that made me feel very shocked. I can't stay like this forever. I have to change. If I don't do my best here, I'll never be able to change for the better. Miss Ashia. What is it, Tomoki? I'm willing to do anything. I'll do everything you tell me to do. Tomoki... I'll get back at Emily Ashia. I started taking acting classes which Miss Ashia recommended me to do, and I took part in all kinds of auditions. Wow, this is so much fun! Even when I was in elementary school, acting never felt as fun as this. I felt like I finally came back to life. Maybe this was my way of communicating. I only got minor roles from these auditions, but it was a huge step forward. The filming process was always very nerve-wracking, but it was a very stimulating and exciting experience. Thank you for today. Goodbye. Half a year ago, I never thought I'll take part in a drama filming. But what surprised me the most was... Great work, Tomoki! You did so great! You didn't look like a newbie at all! Emily Ashia! The fact that Ashia had been waiting for me. Hey, why do you call me by my full name? I I'm sorry, but, but Miss Ashia also here, so... Then you could just call me Emily. Emily? Yup! I'm glad to see you act again! I love the way you act since we were younger! Really? I never knew that. I can't believe she thought that way! You must not like it when I praise you. I know you hate me, Tomoki. Huh? It's not like I hate you! Hmm... Then help me read through the script? Oh, okay. After the two of us returned to the company building, I helped her read through the script for her upcoming movie. Why don't you believe me? I love you so much. Wow. She looks like a whole different person. Her acting was great, and I had a lot to learn from her. As I helped her read through the script multiple times, I realized that she really thought highly of me and that she was very hardworking. And soon, her movie was released to the public. This. In the movie, she played the role of a homeless girl. The role was definitely not easy to portray, but she was perfectly in character. But what surprised me more than that was... Can that homeless girl who approached me at the park that night be... Excuse me, where is Emily? What? She's in the CEO's office. Thank you. May I come in? Oh? What brings you here, Tomoki? Tomoki! 
It was you who approached me at the park that night. Right, Emily? You saw the movie, then. So that's why you knew I was a jobless shut-in. Yeah, I'm sorry I lied to you. I really wanted to see you act again, and... Thank you. Why? For remembering me. You're the reason I got to become an actor now. Tomoki... I'm the one who has to apologize. I blamed everything on you and shut myself in. No. I was surprised at first, but I knew I had to do something. It turned out that she asked her sister to ask me to join the company to help me. Her sister quickly contacted the teacher who taught my acting classes, and after she saw the videos of my past plays, she instantly knew that I had potential and talent. But she was actually panicking inside about how Emily promised a hundred million dollars. So she said she was relieved when I said I didn't need it. So, did you two make up? Yes. Great! Now I can finally tell you two about this. Huh? Ta-da! We have an offer for you two to play the main role in a romance movie. What? It's a movie that depicts a love story between an arrogant CEO's daughter and an impoverished boy. Emily and me, will I be able to do it? You look dissatisfied about having to act as my boyfriend, huh? No, it's not like that. She's already in character. Huh? You'll be my boyfriend from today, okay? Okay. Yay! You're gonna play the role of my boyfriend. Everything went as planned. I really wanted you to play this role. Did you already know everything? A year later, our movie was released to the public. And at the same time, the rumor of us dating was reported to the press. In reality, we were... I'm so sorry. You were just helping me when I lost my balance. Uh, I... So... I like you, Emily. <gasps> Tomoki! We still had a long way to go. But I hope we can be a couple one day. I want to do my best as an actor, completing my tasks one by one, so that Emily can feel proud to have me as her boyfriend. Hello! Thank you so much for watching! I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos! See you all next time! Bye-bye!